First Time Access After you have turned on the router or switch for the first time, there are various ways how to connect to it. Accessing Command Line Interface, CLI, via Telnet, SSH, serial cable or even keyboard and monitor if your router has a VGA card. Accessing Web-based GUI Using the Winbox Configuration Utility, Windows App, compatible with Wine. Serial Cable If your device has a serial port, you can use a console cable, or null modem cable. Plug one end of the serial cable into the console port, also known as a serial port or DB9RS232C asynchronous serial port, of the router board and the other end in your PC, which hopefully runs Windows or Linux. You can also use a USB serial adapter. Run a terminal program, hyperterminal, or putty on Windows, with the following parameters for all router board models except 230. Router board 230 parameters are if parameters are set correctly you should be able to see login prompt. Now you can access router by entering username and password. Accessing web-based GUI Every router is factory pre-configured with the IP address 192.168.88.1-24 on the Ether1 port. The default username is admin with no password, or, for some models with password, check it on the sticker. After you log in for the first time, Please create a new user with a password in the full group, relogin and delete the default admin user. Additional configuration may be set depending on router board model. Most models have the Ether1 configured as a WAN port and any communication with the router through that port is not possible, since it is firewall to protect from any outside access. Using the Winbox Configuration Utility Winbox is a configuration utility that can connect to the router by a MAC or IP protocol. Winbox is a configuration utility that can connect to the router by a MAC or IP protocol. Latest Winbox version can be downloaded from the Crotic download page. Connecting to a device. 1. Run the Winbox utility. 2. Navigate to neighbors. 3. See if Winbox finds your router and its MAC address. Winbox Neighbor Discovery will discover all routers on the broadcast network. 4. If you see your router on the list, connect to it by clicking on IP slash MAC address and pressing connect button. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Your support means a lot. Stay tuned for more exciting content. Until next time. Take care.